Hello, hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. I know you guys are excited for some fascinating royal news. So here we are with your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we move on to any further details, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button now and don't forget to press the bell icon as well. Don't want you guys missing out on any of the royal drama. Well, perfect. Let's get started. All six episodes of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's Netflix docuseries are now out, telling the story of how Harry and Meghan fell in love, got married, had their baby Archie, and stepped back from being working members of the royal family. Now that the full documentary is here, many viewers are wondering, will there be a season two of Harry and Meghan? Well, the answer to that question is yes, but after so much drama and criticism, it might not be about the royal family. After leeching on the royal prestige, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have teased their next Netflix series, which will be a launch at the end of the month. They will be hosting a documentary series called Live to Lead, which is inspired by Nelson Mandela's legacy. According to Netflix, the series, which will launch on December the 31st, will see leaders and activists reflect on their legacies and share themes of bravery, compassion, humility and optimism. The show was created in conjunction with the Nelson Mandela Foundation, Blackwell and Ruth, and Harry and Meghan's Archwell Productions. A teaser was launched where Prince Harry says, this was inspired by Nelson Mandela, who once stated that what counts in life is not the mere fact that we have lived, but what impact we have made in the lives of others to assess the worth of the life we lead. This series announcement comes just days after the conclusion of their own controversial docuseries, Harry and Meghan, in which they made various assertions about their time in the royal family. The pair previously gave a candid interview to Oprah Winfrey in which they discussed why they chose to separate themselves from the royal family and made headline-grabbing remarks about their son, Archie. Buckingham and Kensington Palace have both stayed silent in response to Harry's charges. In his controversial six-part series, Harry also alleged that Kensington Palace lied to protect his brother when it released a statement rejecting a rumour that William had bullied him out of the royal family. So what do you think, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments. Until then, thank you for watching. We'll see you again soon with some more interesting news about the royal family. Hasta la vista.